Hi and welcome to Empower TV. My name is Josephine Campbell, but Empower TV is about you. This is the channel for you who'd like to empower yourself and your business so you get more success and happiness. And today we have a Q&A and I've received a letter from Annette who is 52 years old and she is a middle level manager. Annette has been on sick leave because she's been suffering from stress and she's been away from her job for four months. And now Annette writes me because she just returned to her job and she is a little worried about how to be strong and, and take the authority that she normally holds. She's also nervous that she's gonna have a breakdown again. And in general, how to deal with the situation because she feels a little bit under pressure. The organization where Annette works have been going through a lot of changes and that might have been some of the reasons why Annette has been suffering from stress. So, here is my answer to Annette. Dear Annette, thank you for writing and I do understand if you find that this situation is a bit difficult for you because it's not easy to go back to work after being on sick leave suffering from stress. The thing is that 50% of the people who are on sick leave with stress and go back to work, they go back on sick leave again because the situation that they're in when they get back is not ideal. So here is what it requires for the situation to be ideal. And I really hope that you got a very good manager who will take care of you because you need that to do well. So the thing is, you cannot work full hours and you cannot have the same position just when you return. You need to be protected. And you need your manager and your HR partner to collaborate on protecting you. So you need to work less hours in the beginning, you need to have a fixed schedule and you need your manager to act as a filter. Meaning that it's, don't have, be in that situation where people from all over the organization can contact you and give you responsibilities and jobs. Your boss needs to be a filter someone who decides for what you to do for what for, uh, what you should do and what you shouldn't do the only one who can give you tasks so you only have to relate to that and you need to go easy on yourself and you need to have a lot of breaks not work evenings not work weekends in some jobs this is difficult but um, it's the only way if you want to be sure that you don't get ill again and then you also have to manage your expectations for what you can do and what you can't do. The good news is if you do this well, you can get back to work on full power after a period of time. That period of time can vary, but in most cases it's about three months. Okay, so good luck to you and to all of you who are watching this video, please give us a thumbs up or thumbs down or leave us a comment. We'd love to hear what you got to say. Thank you.